Golden Papali'i is with us, and I hope I pronounced that exactly right. Correct me if I'm wrong there. Is that how you say your last name? I want to get it right. Yeah, that's it, bro. Yeah, Thank yeah. you so much. All good. All right. Captain of the Blues, first game up is Saturday night. Look, I was really intrigued and interested, and um, I thought your comments at the beginning of the season about uh, you know that rock under the beach towel that last year's final was was excellent. It, you know because as a as a professional player, as the captain, you should be hurting after losing that final. Is that is that how you feel? Oh, uh, I, I wouldn't be human if I did, wasn't hurting. You know, so like to be honest, we've yeah, it's it's still laying there. But to be honest, it's a new year, new team, and you know we got we got uh, goals to fucking bloody win it all. So that's that's it. And you have to, don't you? You can't approach any season without thinking that the prize is actually winning it. The prize isn't playing well and making it, is it? It's winning it. Yeah, 100%. Like, well, why do we play Super Rugby, you know? It's to win the whole thing. We're not just, you know, trying to participate and, you know, and, yeah, just participate. We want to win the whole thing, you know? So, yeah. Dalton, where is the team at from what you're looking at in your mind than they were a year ago? Can you see what improvements are there? Oh, it's hard to say because we actually haven't played. You know, we've we've learned from our preseason games. You know, a few things around our game plan and you know around um you know how how we going into as a forward pack mainly how we uh, you know dealing with um dealing with you know Romano not being here. He he, he was a massive help, but we've got the help of Paddy back and and it's it's added a new flavour to the team. So, um yeah. Yeah, sorry, sorry, mate. I've just bloody finished training. That's all right. Now you're fine. Like, no, that's right. No, just absolutely. Look, you're absolutely fine. And you know, the other thing is, you 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 played with a freedom last year. But what I like with your forward pack is you played relentless and hard. Is that the same kind of focus that you get that you that you want to bring this year? Yeah, hundred percent. You know, we, we've been a team that we've always had the talent, but we I think, you know, when I first came in, I think we lacked a bit of that that hard work. But I think last year we got the balance right between. You know, we had the Rough Riders and we had the dogs in the forward pack and we had the talent out the back. And I think that we, we got that balance right. And once we once we noticed that and we actually we executed and we actually played like we wanted to, man, we were we were a dangerous team. And like you said, you know, we, we came short at the end, but I think this just adds more fuel to our fire. So, yeah. And, you know, the way that you play as well, I mean, it's just rip shit and bust, mate. It's just physical, isn't it? How much do you love getting in there and whacking guys? Oh, man, yeah. Yeah, I love it, man. You know, I, I sort of see it as a bit of trench warfare. You know, I love I love stuff about the army and the military, and you know, going out there and get, you know getting into battle. And you look beside you and you see your mates uh, out there going through the going through the hurt locker with you, man. It, it sort of gets me up. You know, it's, I love love that sort of stuff. So yeah, yeah, you love the combat. Yeah, hundred percent. Yeah. Um, and also, as far as your positioning goes, I mean, look, we sit here in fanland and we argue about this the whole time. God, is Dalton an eight? Is he a six? Is he a seven? What are you, bro? What do you want to be? What's your, what's your best spot? Oh man, I want to play, I want to play seven. You know, the good thing about I know uh, as a player for me, I know I can cover all three. But the main job I really want is number seven, and I feel I can play with more freedom there. I don't need to really think about you know too much of my roles. I, I, I sort of play more freely when I play seven, so that's that's the main one. And what do you what do you look at in terms of playing seven? What's the first thing in your mind? Is it to attack that guy? Uh to be honest, the main thing is just having fun. And the, when when I say fun it's it's more of the you know, going into war and going into combat, you know, getting that physicality, you know, going back into, you know, trench warfare with the boys. So I love that sort of stuff. So that's that's sort of my mindset when I when I know I'm playing seven. As a captain, what kind of a captain are you, mate? How would you describe yourself as a captain? Oh, to be honest, I want to lead first. That's that's if I don't get my job right, I can't be demanding, you know, demanding the boys to work hard for me if I don't if I don't you know show them that I want to that I'm working hard as well. But to be honest, I, I, I the areas that I lack in, I know I have leaders around me like guys like Baz, Paddy, Rico, and the guys like Tom Robinson who who have uh, you know my weaknesses are some some of their strengths and some of their weaknesses are my strengths. So. You know, we feed off each other, and that's they, they've made a massive part in, in, you know, sort of my leadership role at the Blues, so yeah. Dalton Pabali is with us. He must be fun to play with Tom Robinson, mate. He looks like a hell of a dude. I like the guy. Eh? Oh, yeah. He's a, bit, he's a bit of a character, but, you know, we've got a lot of characters in this team, and it, and it sort of makes us uh, sort of a fun team, and, you know, we look forward to going into work every day, so yeah. So, okay, yeah. one more question before we go. Are you, the kind of, are you the kind of guy that thrives on the captaincy? Is it something, as far as you're concerned, that this is actually going to elevate you? Yeah, I think it elevated me last year. You know, this is something that holds me accountable. So I've just got to keep, you know, working on my craft and keep being responsible.